Hi, welcome to Brain Equation. Today's question is x to the power 2 minus y to the power 2 is equal to 100. x, y are natural numbers and we are going to find out the values of x and y. So, let's get started. x square minus y square is equal to 100. By using the formula a square minus b square is equal to a plus b times a minus b. So expression will become x plus y times x minus y is equal to 100. So factors of 100 factors. The factors are 1 multiplied by 100 and 100 multiplied by 1 and the next one is 25 multiplied by 4 and 4 multiplied by 25 and the next factor is 2 multiplied by 50 and 50 multiplied by 2 and 5 multiplied by 20 and 20 multiplied by 5 and the last one is 10 multiplied by 10. So these are the factor x plus y is greater than greater than x minus y. If we add y on both sides x plus y plus y is greater than x minus y plus y so plus y and minus y will cancel out and we will get x plus 2y greater than x so that's why this expression is greater than the second one so by using this condition i am going to pick only those cases those factors in which first factor is greater than the second one 100 multiplied by 1 25 multiplied by 4 50 is greater than 2 and 20 multiplied by 5 so they here 1 is less than 100 4 is less than 25 2 is less than 50 these both are same so we will reject them so we have we have almost four cases x plus y times x minus y is equal to 100 multiplied by 1 and x plus y times x minus y is equal to 25 multiplied by 4 and x plus y times x minus y is equal to 50 multiplied by 2. And the last one x plus y times x minus y is equal to 20 multiplied by 5. 20 multiplied by 5. So we have four cases now. 1, 2, 3 and 4. So, case 1, case 1, x plus y times x minus y is equal to 100 multiplied by 1. So, x plus y is equal to 100 and x minus y is equal to 1. So, we will add these two equations by adding x plus y x minus y plus 
x plus y is equal to 100 and x minus y is equal to 1. So here we will get 2x, y will cancel out with y and 100, 101, which implies that x is equal to 101 over 2. Now next, by subtracting these two equations, x plus y is equal to 100, x minus y is equal to 1, now subtracting. So here the sign will be minus here plus x will cancel out with x. We will get 2y is equal to 100 minus 1 will give 99 which implies that y is equal to 99 over 2. So this number is a fraction. It does not belong to a natural number. It's not a natural number. And 99 over 2 also is not a natural number. So we are going to reject this case reject it. Now case 2 x plus y times x minus y is equal to 25 multiplied by 4 25 so x plus y is equal to 25, x minus y is equal to 4, x plus y is equal to 25 and x minus y is equal to 4. So by adding these two equations, we will get 2x is equal to 24 plus 25 plus 4 is 29 which implies that x is equal to 29 over so by subtracting here by adding and now subtracting we will get 2y is equal to 25 minus 4 is 21 which implies that y is equal to 21 over 2 so these both numbers are fractions both are fraction does not belong to natural numbers does not belong to natural number so this case is also rejected now case 3 now case 3 x plus y times x minus y is equal to is equal to 20 multiplied by 5 so x plus y is equal to 20 and x minus y is equal to 5 so by adding these two equations we will get 2x, 2x is equal to 20 plus 5 is 25 which implies that x is equal to 25 over 2 and by subtracting these two equations we will get 2y is equal to 20 minus 5 is 15 which implies that y is equal to 15 over 2 so again these two both numbers are not natural numbers so we this case is also rejected case 4 x plus y times x minus y is equal to 50 multiplied by 2 
So x plus y is equal to 50, x minus 2 is equal to, x minus y is equal to 2. x plus y is equal to 50 and x minus y is equal to 2 by adding these two equations. Now we are going to add them. Adding, we will get 2x is equal to 50 plus 2 is 52 which implies that x is equal to 52 over 2 by dividing 52 by 2 we will get x is equal to 26. So now by subtracting by subtracting we will get 2y is equal to 48 50 minus 2 is 48 which implies that y is equal to 48 divided by 2 y is equal to 24 so here we have x is equal to 26 it is a natural number and y belongs to a natural number and y is equal to 24 it is also a natural number so we will consider this case we will accept it these are the required values now we need to check these values check x square minus y square is equal to 100 left hand side of this equation is x square minus y square so x is 26 and y is 24 26 square minus 24 square so 26 square is So in the next step, 26 square is 676 and 24 square is 576. Now we will subtract these two values. 676 minus 576 will give 100 which is equal to right hand side. So left hand side is equal to right hand side. So in this question, x is equal to 26 and y is equal to 24 are the required values. These are the natural numbers. So all the, don't forget these steps. All steps are very important. So that's all about this question. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe my channel for more solutions and videos. Till the next video. Bye.